If you do need to flash your BIOS on your motherboard in order to have your CPU post, it's very easy to do. Your motherboard must have the BIOS flashback feature, a button, typically on the back I.O. panel, but it can often be on the board itself. You need a USB drive that's between 8 and 32 gigabytes, but no larger than that. Using Windows on another computer, format the drive as FAT32 in the file manager. You can name the volume whatever you want. Download the BIOS that you need from the manufacturer's motherboard support page. Extract the BIOS, then right-click the BIOS file on the thumb drive and rename it based on who makes the motherboard. Make sure the USB drive is put into the correct port and that the EPS power cables in the upper left hand corner of the motherboard are connected along with the 24 pin motherboard power connector on the right side of the motherboard. Make sure the PSU is plugged in and turned on. Push and hold the BIOS flashback button until you see an LED start flashing on the motherboard. Now leave the board alone until the motherboard light is done flashing. Once it's done flashing, power off your PSU and build the PC. 